What is up? In there, army, I am Gamer5 coming at you with another video. What is up, everybody? It is a new video. It is a trailer breakdown and we're gonna watch the trailer here too. But, um, I had to bring this together lightning fast as, um, if you didn't know, um, the day I'm recording this, it was announced, but you guys are seeing this Friday. Um, there was a new Plants vs. Zombies game announced. And, of course, today, we are going to watch the trailer, and I'm going to tell you what's coming, what's new. I'm going to tell you when this is coming, being that it's actually coming relatively soon. So, stick with me. Uh, let's get into it. Let's jump into it. So, let's get into it right now. Okay, first things first, let's go with the trailer. Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. That's the name for, uh, that's the name of the, um, of the new game. And, uh, yeah, so, let's, um, let's show you. Let's show you it. Welcome to Neighborville, where from town center, to the weirding woods, to the trails of Mount Steep, a battle is always raging. New plants, new zombies, and new turf. This is your first look at Plants vs. Zombies, Battle for Neighborville. You'll begin your battle in the world's social regions. These hubs are the gateway into Neighborville, and a great place to connect with friends, find new allies, and try on a new look. Let's meet the new recruits. New team play classes let you join up with your friends and fight together as one unstoppable unit. Meet Oak and Acorn. Or bring your cadets cool. together and form a space station. Now you can play on your friends and with your friends in split screen co-op in every mode. Team play awesome. classes are powerful, but if you go down, you all go down. Oh, As great. Team, That's not good. Let's meet our new damage dealers. The 80s action hero. Oh. She was his bow, <laughs> then zing you with an unintelligible one-liner. So gnarly. Snapdragon launches fireballs that will <laughs> seek out zombie kindling. Burn. Electric slide will dance her way into your hearts. Her electrified attacks can clear wow. any dance floor. Okay, then. Don't blink. Or you'll miss Nightcap, Master of Shadows. She gets in close for a devastating Fung Fu takedown. What the? Do you need to head say to head Fung combat Fu? is at the heart of Battle for Neighborville. Spread across 12 unique maps, there is something for everyone. Go intense in the Thunderdome, home of the all new Battle Arena, where two teams enter and one team leaves. Go big in up to 24 player matches. With countless objectives, whatever you do, Please stop Dr. Zomboss from launching a lighthouse into Zassa. orbit? Did anyone Reload just see that? Reload and jump into the fray at a drop-in, never-ending carnival of headshots. <laughs> headshots! The battle for Neighborville doesn't hey. stop there. Hop on a train, submarine, or flying bus, and explore strange and dangerous free-roam regions. Quest, collect, and discover as you battle an entire forest. Join a pie-eating contest. Make friends with an insecure washing machine. Crash a dance party. Fight inside your own zombie mind. Survive gnomish temples. Lead a zombie parade. Give a lawnmower a style makeover. And politely decline to hacky sack with this guy. What the? You know, just your average day. The battle for Neighborville is just getting started. With countless ways to join the fight, one thing is clear. This war is just about as weird as you. I mean that in the best possible way. There's no good way! Jeez! Dude, you're an idiot. Why would you say that? Oh, right. Bah. Thank you. Okay. 
So, yes, Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville, it's coming very soon. Um, let's uh, just fix this. There we go. It's coming very soon, Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Looks like it's actually going to be very fun, and there's, uh, as the guy said, uh, there is, um, Three new plants and three new zombies. He went very fast, so I will um go by what the website has, and I will tell you their names and everything. So, let's start off, of course, with the plants. Let me just bring up EA's website. Well, more Plants vs. Zombies website. And, uh... Now, this guy is probably... One of my favorite uh, guys in the entire out of all the new guys for the plants. This is probably one of my favorites. If you didn't know, I I have both Garden Warfare One, Garden Warfare Two. I'm gonna kind of call this Garden Warfare Three. It seems kind of like that. But um. This guy is probably going to be one of my favorites. It is Oak and Acorn. His class is Defend. So he's a defense class. Well, no matter what, he looks pretty darn cool. And he has a Acorn that, go, that you can have with him. And you can also team up to launch Super Sap Traps and more with Oak and Acorn. So that's that's cool. Um, I'm I'm reading you uh, what uh, is on the website. Um, there's also log tree tremend log tremendous vanquishes with this mighty pair. <laughs> I get it. I get it. That's funny. But um, as you can see, he looks insane. He looks insanely funny. And I think I'm going to actually have a blast playing as him. And uh, first things first, all the old characters are back. So everyone's back. Yay. I'm okay with that. So let's move on. Next one. Next one. He's one of the attack. And he's kind of a weird looking pea shooter. Uh, I would throw a picture of the pea shooter up on the screen. But I'm not going to do that. If you know what a pea, sh pea shooter looks like, um, uh, it looks kind of like that. Just really weird. It has a dragon head. And, um, I don't know if he'll be that good. That's, um, gonna be interesting to see. But, um, you can blaze a trail through zombie foes with the flame-blowing Snapdragon. And I find that kind of cool. I don't think there's really any, um, plants that can actually shoot fire originally. Like, without... The getting a upgraded version, if that's even in this game. So I kind of find that cool, and you guys might find it lame, and I understand that. But we'll we'll see how that would work in the game. Um, but yeah. The next. Plant the last plant that um is coming, and that is Nightcap. This guy is insane, and I love him, but I just don't think he'll be one of the characters I'll use. He's this is what it says on um he, he's an attack. Both him and Snapdragon are attacks, are attack plants. It says, 
Stick to the shadows with Nightcap and seek more sneakily than you've ever snuck before. Then unleash the mushroom martial art. Fung Fu! I find it awesome that they have Fung Fu! Like they could have easily say Kung Fu, but no, 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 no. It's Fung Fu! <laughs> It's awesome, it's funny, it seems like something Pets vs. Zombies would come up with. So, hey! So, Nightcap, that looks amazing. I love the character model, just... I think, out of all of them, I'm, Oak and Acorn is probably gonna be the coolest. But, um... It kinda depends what I say about the new zombie. Again, there's three of them. There's one defend and two attack. So let's uh, start off with attack uh, with one of the attack. Um, one of the new zombies is electrical slide. Basically, what I think this character is is the uh playable version of the disco zombie from Garden Warfare One and Garden Warfare Two. Been that, um, it, on the plant side, they were re real annoying. <laughs> and, uh, on, on the, um, zombie side, hey, they made good teammates. But, um, they're, uh, I like the design. It's definitely interesting. I would definitely go to say that. Has a bunch of lightning bolts all around it. That's different. And, then, uh, let's, uh, I'll actually read what they have. Live wires in every sense. Electric slides light up every battle with their relentless dancing and shockingly amped up attacks. So, I'm guessing it has, uh, again, for... Another one, this is the first one that actually, an another one that has an element and, yeah, lightning. D right off the bat, that's actually kind of cool. Just, uh, it doesn't look like one I'd use. It doesn't, at all. Um, and then, uh, who do we have next? Ah! The other attack, the other new attack zombie, and that is the 80s action hero. This guy looks awesome. I love him. He he might actually be my favorite zombie. I love the imp. I, I, not the imp. What's his name? Is he even in this game? Imp. Yeah, it is imp. Imp and z -Mac. He's one of my, him and the foot soldier I love, and um, I feel like uh, the eighties uh, the eighties action hero will sort of be like both of them. So I think I'll like them. I think I'm gonna really like him, and uh, let's, let's um, let's uh, show you. I'll uh, tell you what it. I'll read out what they have on the website here. Um, zombies of few words and fewer thoughts. Their bows have been looking to make friends ever since a plant insulted their hairdo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I will. I would have made fun of the hairdo also, but okay. <laughs> um. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. I like him, and it's gonna be interesting to see uh, all these characters in the game. And um, of course, there's one left. The the new defense zombie space cadet. That is a very generic name, and I don't really like it. But eh. It kind of goes with the theme of um, Do Dr. Zomboss wanting to shoot a. You know, wanting to launch a lighthouse into space. 
kind of has a good thing to do with that. But, um, this one reminds me a lot of the imp, being that, I'm, from what I'm guessing, it, it's small, they can be, they're small, but they can go into it. I find that cool. So let's, uh, I'll read you out, uh, what they have written down for Space Cadet. Space Cadet may be small, but don't let size throw you. Okay. Her targeted laser and boosters make up for it. And when she teams up. Okay. Wow. That's, um, not the bestly worded, but okay. Um, it looks, and she, she might not be someone I would play as, but she does look, um, interesting. But, uh, yeah. I think that's all I have. Yes, um, now, of course, when is this coming out? Well, I can tell you the that Plants vs. Zombies ba Battle for Neighborville will be out on October. 18th. That is not far away at all. And if you want it early, you get the Founders Edition. But I'm not getting the Founders Edition. But, um, it's cool. I. It's cool to get another, um, Plants vs. Zombies game. We knew something was in the works. So, uh, it's glad to. I'm glad to see it come. And I'm also glad that we have some new plants that look awesome. We got new zombies that look silly, that look dorky, even. Um, so, find it cool. It's awesome that they're um, bringing it back. And, um, yeah, so... Until the next video, this is GameNator5 signing off. That will be it for this. Uh, I just want to get this out to you guys. Um, so, this is GameNator5 signing off. See you later in the army. Stay cool and have fun. And see you later in the army. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, for the video, share the video with your family and friends. And I hope to see you all in the next video. See you later in the army. Stay cool and have fun.